Estos vestidos son muy bonitos. ¿Qué te parecen? ¿Y esas faldas? ¿Te gustan? ¡Ah! Aquellas camisas son preciosas. ¿Te gusta aquella camisa roja? This, these, that, and those are the English demonstrative adjectives. Spanish also has demonstrative adjectives and pronouns. You learn the forms for this, este, esta, estos, estas, in the last chapter. Unlike English, the Spanish demonstratives must agree in number and gender with the noun that they modify or refer to. Spanish also includes two ways of referring to that and those, one being more remote or farther away than the other. The first of these, ese, esa, esos, and esas, are equivalent to English that and those. The other set of demonstrative adjectives that correspond to that and those, aquel, aquella, aquellos, and aquellas, are less frequently used but are particularly useful when pointing out something or someone even farther away than another thing. The rough equivalent to these in English would be to say that or those way over there. Este abrigo, esta gorra, ese abrigo, esa gorra, aquel abrigo, aquella gorra, estos abrigos, estas gorras, esos abrigos, esas gorras, aquellos abrigos, aquellas gorras. Está bien, vamos a practicar. Let's practice. Give the Spanish equivalent to the English demonstrative adjectives provided. Be sure to pay attention to number and gender agreement. Número uno. These pantalones. Did you say estos? Excelente. Número dos. That. Falda. Was your answer esa? Perfecto. Número tres. That over there. Suéter. Did you say aquel? Muy bien. Número cuatro. Those. Camisas. Did you say esas? Fantástico. Número cinco. This. Abrigo. Was your answer este? Magnífico. Again, like English, Spanish also uses the demonstrative adjectives as pronouns. To refer to something or someone already mentioned, you may simply use the demonstrative without the noun, the equivalent of the English this one, that one, these, those. In this exchange, demonstrative pronouns are used two times. Can you spot them? ¿Compras esa camisa? ¿Cuál? Esa de color café. No, prefiero aquella. So, did you spot the two demonstrative pronouns? Here they are. Muy bien. Finally, there are three neuter demonstratives in Spanish. Esto, eso, and aquello. These are used to refer to unidentified objects or entire situations, ideas, or concepts. Look at these three expressions using neuter pronouns. ¿Qué es esto? Eso es todo. Aquello es terrible. Vamos a practicar un poco más. Now let's practice a little more. Complete the correct answer to each question based on the English cue. Número uno. ¿Qué blusa prefieres? Prefiero this one. Did you answer esta? Excelente. Número dos. ¿Qué zapatos quieres comprar? Quiero comprar those over there. Did you answer aquellos? Muy bien. Número tres. ¿Por qué no quieres leer el poema en clase? Yo no puedo hacer that.
Did you answer eso? Fantástico. Número 4. ¿Qué botas compras? Compro these. Did you answer estas? Perfecto. Número 5. ¿Qué reloj prefieres llevar? Prefiero that one. Did you answer ese? Perfecto. Esta lección ya termina. Eso es todo. Keep in mind that the demonstrative adjectives must agree in number and gender with the noun that they modify, just like other Spanish adjectives. ¡Hasta la próxima!